throw. He is going to do it. He is unbeaten. What guts. Honestly, I walked up that two fly. It was very emotional for me because I had the same sensation. You know, everything was kind of like a slow build up for me. I know it sounds crazy, but that last underwater, I was literally just thinking about London and I put down on my cheeks and uh, closed my eyes and, and, and you know, tried to come off the wall as hard as I could. Uh, it was a beautiful moment for me and you know, I just, uh, I'm very happy that I won that. It's, it's special, you know, whoever was with me in that race, I, I felt like I was destined to win that tuna fly. I really wanted to win an MVP before, um, it's before Vegas or try and win an MVP. I was very lucky tonight, I only beat Sarah by half a point. So, I think that silver in that uh, 103, that Thai silver got me the half a point, so I'm very happy. Um, but more happy that the team won, of course, that's the most important thing, and that we you know, won the derby and now we're heading to Vegas and uh, we're in good form, so we're very excited. We have a really great team chemistry, um, but I think also must give a lot of credit to the coaches. Um, I think James got it spot on with the tactics, uh, switching uh, swimmers, you know, resting guys for relays or not resting them for relays. and. So we're not taking uh, anybody um, lightly. We know that Vegas will be very tough. You know, almost like the fighters, you know? Back in uh, MGM Grand, uh, now it's the Mandolin Bay, uh, 12, 13,000 people looking forward to it. Couldn't ask for anything better to end of the year off.